have a slow up, no I don't take shit, I got no love for the fakeness If you wanna play tough and wanna hate this, I'll show up I don't ever slow up, no I don't take shit, I got no love for the fakeness CBS is the bold and the beautiful sports reveal that Rich and Taylor's relationship has been doing pretty well since he proposed to her. Rich made a rather abrupt decision when he chose the return of Taylor and then went to propose. He did all of that at times when he lost his temper over the matter of misunderstanding with Brooke. Furthermore, Rich and Brooke are not yet divorced on paper, which hurts Brooke a lot when she learns he's back and married again to Taylor. Just when Rich was a little hesitant, wondering what to do when he saw Brooke so hurt, Taylor gave him a surprise. Taylor bought Wyatt's beach house, and this house used to be here when Taylor and Rich were married. After the divorce, the two of them wanted to erase the memories here, so they sold it to Wyatt. Taylor cherished the idea of buying the house since she wanted to return to Rich. As soon as Rich and Taylor got back together, she reached out to Wyatt to negotiate the sale of the house. Unfortunately, Wyatt agreed and they completed the process. Rich was surprised by Taylor's actions, and he was touched to see how much she loved him. Will this gift make Rich stop wondering? Hesitant before Taylor and Brooke, would Ridge be happy to walk down the aisle with Taylor without regretting the decision? What will happen? Meanwhile, the troubles related to Thomas had not stopped. There is still tension between Hope and Thomas since the fight for custody of Douglas. Of course, Thomas got his son back as he wanted, but Hope wouldn't let go like that. She often visits Douglas for fear that Thomas will not take good care of him. Moreover, Hope is also trying to find a way to legally bring Douglas to foster care. Hope loved Douglas too much to ignore everyone's advice, and she only put her own desires first, and also forgot what Douglas really wanted. Therefore, Thomas and Hope met so often that the people around them also annoyed for them. Liam also tried to stop Hope, but she refused, so he just had to accept it despite the worry about their emotional development. But Steffi didn't stay silent when he heard the information. Steffi knows well how Thomas once loved Hope, and how much pain after Hope's marriage she did to express his feelings. Now Steffi doesn't want Thomas to go through such, such sessions again. She really wanted her brother to be happy and not have to do with Hope anymore, so Steffi went to Hope and warned her to stay away from Thomas, for whatever reason. But does Hope heed Steffi's warnings, and do you still continue to do what you want? What measures will Steffi take if Hope continues to do so? How will things turn out?